welcome to my channel Main Street Orlando. My name is Josie and today we are at the Art of Disney in Disney Springs. Let's go! Today's video is going to be about Thomas Kincaid Studios event going on here at the Art of Disney in Disney Springs. This event is going on until the 31st of July. They are selling new Disney Dreams collection art pieces as well as other um, prior art pieces. A lot of them are limited edition and they are doing also sketches and signing with the purchase of a Disney Dreams collection art piece. Three of the artists from the Thomas Kincaid Studios Studios will be making appearances here and they're the ones who will be sketching and signing for you when you purchase the art piece and also we will see that they have their biographies up and it's so beautiful I came here yesterday and I saw what they had going on and I was like I have to vlog this and I have to show you guys and I cannot wait and by the way if you don't know where the art of Disney is located it is close or right in front of the days of Christmas shop and next to the Rainforest Cafe restaurant. So before starting, I had to stop by the wonderful world of memories and join the virtual queue to pick up the new Walt Disney World annual pass holder magnet and it's Orange Bird this time and I love it. I'm so excited. They give you a little flyer where you can scan the QR code and bring your magnet to life and they also gave me this Orange Bird scavenger hunt that you can find or where you can find Orange Bird throughout all of Disney Springs all through the month of July. So we're in and it says Art of Disney presents Thomas Kincaid July 1st to the 31st and you have daily artist signings from 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. Let's begin with the framed limited edition art pieces and I will try to show you as many prices as I can and I want to start with this Cinderella one which they have displayed closer to the entrance and if you see here in the bottom it says Cinderella dancing in the starlight Thomas Kincaid Studios look how beautiful it even has I don't know if the camera can pick it up but it has sparkles her dress has sparkles and there's sparkles throughout this whole piece and it is amazing guys and here in the bottom it has a signature and it says it's 27 out of only 55 you see what I mean by limited edition and what I love about Thomas Kincaid is that you just stare at the art piece and you just find little details here and there everywhere and it's so much fun so they have this entire wall and I want to start here with this little mermaid piece when she gets married in her wedding dress and her wedding dress is inspired by 80s wedding dress which I love and Little Mermaid I would say is one of my favorite princesses my other favorite princess is um, Rapunzel but Little Mermaid I love because it is one of the princesses or the movies where they use the most colors and the colors are so vibrant and fun I really love her merch tell me and comment down below what's your favorite Disney princess I would like to know so here is this one and this art piece says it's a thousand two hundred and eighty dollars it comes with this frame and look at her castle and all the little characters throughout the movie this is what I mean by their art pieces look at Ursula my goodness this is beautiful guys and the one that they have here is number two out of 300 pieces they have a mary poppins returns art piece for the same price of 1280 look at this guys and this one comes with a golden frame look at this look at the details on this frame Right on top, they have a Mickey and Minnie sleigh, what is it, evening sleigh rides. And let me try and get closer so you can see this, I would say it's a Christmas piece. Yeah, it's a Christmas piece. So cute. Here's another Little Mermaid piece and I love this one even more. And what I say about Little Mermaid is the colors. Just look at the colors of all of her sister's tails. 
and then they kind of like match with all of the sea life under the sea it's so beautiful and her red hair come on guys i love this it has prince prince eric's castle which later becomes her castle too i love this and this one comes with like this this golden frame but it's like a soft gold it goes so perfectly with this piece and i think this one yeah this one is a little more expensive it's 2595 of course everything that i like is the most expensive and this one is 84 out of 95. they have a maleficent piece with the bird and then look at all the other characters oh my goodness this 50th anniversary piece is way up top but i'll show you guys the wrapped canvases because they are selling smaller canvases and a way more affordable price and i can't wait to show you that but first i wanted to show you these framed gallery these framed uh, pieces framed art pieces and this one guys the camera cannot do its justice it has glitter and shine all throughout the piece i'm gonna try and zoom in here but on the balloons it has glitter on the fireworks it has glitter all throughout main street the greenery it just shines and it really does show 50th anniversary except without the crowds that's that that's not really real <laughs> but this is so cool and it's also for the price of 2595 and by the way you guys you can use your annual pass discount or a cast member discount towards a purchase and it's 10 percent this is the mad hatter tea party piece and it has alice with the mad hatter look at the queen back there oh wow so many different elements from the movie the flower we have cheshire cat here Ooh, he's always late I love this. Donald and Daisy, a duck day afternoon, and they're at the beach. Look at them with their Mickey and Minnie phone case, taking pictures with his nephews, and we have Mickey and friends playing volleyball at the beach. This is so cool, and a sunset. We have this Rapunzel piece up top, and I hope I'm able to show you this when I go to the canvases. But it's a Rapunzel dancing in the sunlit courtyard, and it's that scene where he's dancing when she's dancing with Eugene. And wow, this piece really shines. That golden color used, it's the title is perfect. Sunlit, that's what it looks like. And I just love this with all the different elements. It has her parents in a painting on the left side with Maximus. Lady in the Tramp falling in love. How gorgeous is this? And they're bringing some pasta over to them from Tony's. They have their friends. Oh my goodness. Just the scenery. Another Christmas art piece. And here we have Mickey and Minnie Christmas Lodge. And they're at the campfire. Oh, look. They have Chip and Dale roasting marshmallows along with them and please if anybody knows who they are Maybe I live under a rock. I don't know Who are they? Is this their children? Is this their children? I would love to know We have Donald Duck's nephews Pluto making a snowman goofy uh, he's fishing <laughs> in a frozen lake oh daisy duck and donald taking a stroll in the snow this is so pretty and this one is a thousand two hundred and eighty just like the lady and the tramp one this one up top is called mickey and minnie candy cane express and what i see this is another christmas piece and they are boarding the candy cane express here they have a Lion King one. It's called Return to Pride Rock. And we have Nala and Simba, Timon and Pumbaa with their grub. This was Simba and Nala when they were kids. We have Rafiki. Oh, we even have Scar and the hyenas. Size canvases.
canvases and they are 14 by 14 candid canvas wraps for 99 dollars so they are not the original pieces they look more like you know printed on canvas but 99 dollars is not bad you guys so let me show you out of the ones that i showed you they do have the alice one and since it's a 14 by 14 it is going to crop out other elements on the sides of the original artwork so here in this one for example you can see the queen so you can see her right here on the wrap side but not on the front of the piece they have the cinderella one they have the one of daisy and donald duck at the beach with their nephews they have the christmas piece with the candy cane express they also have the Lady and the Tramp piece, but they also have pieces we haven't seen, I haven't seen in large or the original ones. For example, this one of Mickey giving many flowers. We have also this one where it looks like they're in Hawaii. I'm gonna take a wild guess and guess this is at Hawaii. Mickey with the ukulele, mini dancing. Oh, she's wearing Crocs she's wearing crocs how cute is that look at pluto with his little bucket and just this rainbow the mountains this one's really pretty they also have a beauty and the beast one how beautiful this gives me like bridgerton vibes no no you don't think so they also have mickey oh mickey again with these little mouses are they their kids i'm gonna have to ask and then we have um the donald duck's nephews mickey uh riding mini plus mickey in a heart this is so cute this one's really pretty at the beach and they have another christmas piece here where they're just kind of decorating their homes for christmas we have an Aristocats piece in Paris with the Eiffel Tower. We have O'Malley the Alley Cat with Marie and her brothers. Look at the musicians. This is beautiful. We have Mickey and Minnie in Paris. And they just picked up some bread and flowers under the rain. And we have Pluty and Goofo Goofy. Pluto and Goofy having a Sunday. Okay, and here we have even smaller canvases for only $59, guys. $59. Not bad at all. But before I show you that, they have the three artists that are premiering or you know they're making appearances here at the Disney Springs they're doing the signings and the sketches when you purchase um, one of these art pieces so we have Jenna McMullins we have Dirk Wonder Lick and then we have Joseph Jacobetic so I'm trying my best not to mispronounce, but these are the three amazing artists. We have Pinocchio with the blue fairy. We have Mickey and Minnie at a cottage. So we did see this one in the gallery wrap, this one in the gallery wrap. This is Mickey and Minnie in Greece. Oh look, and we have Goofy, Donald Duck, and Daisy. Goofy is the server here. Mickey and Minnie at the movie theater watching Steamboat Willie and they have their nephews, their friends. I mean, Donald's nephews. There he is, there's Donald Duck, there's Chip. We have a Dumbo piece here, a 101 Dalmatians, a Jasmine and Aladdin on the magic carpet. And here we have the small Cinderella piece. And since this one is smaller, let's compare it to the 14 by 14. So the smaller $59 one is more rectangular, of course, than the 14 by 14. So the crop a factor in this is different so the 14 by 14 crops the castle a little more while this one 
does not crop the castle. But in the 14 by 14, it crops the castle, but you can see one of the mice, which is Jack. And in this smaller one, you do not see any of the mice unless you turn it around and you see the wrapping. Here is another 101 Dalmatians one. Oh, how pretty. And we have here the Christmas one. So here's the one with the Candy Cane Express, the one where they're all at the beach, which we saw in a 14 by 14. This one as well, the one in Hawaii. This I have not seen in any of the other pieces or no, I did I see this? Yes, we did. Hold on. No, we did not. So I got it confused. So we saw this one, which is called Little Mermaid from the Disney Dreams collection. And then we have this one, which is totally different because Prince Eric is on a boat and she's holding his hand from the water. Oh, and here at the bottom, you can see Atlantica with her father. So here is the small canvas wrap that is $59 that I saw of my favorite original Little Mermaid painting. So let's compare it. So here is the large painting you see with all the details and then this is the small one. So it does have a big crop factor, but it's still beautiful. It's still beautiful. Here is the small Lion King piece. They have another Cinderella one. Oh wow, he's holding flowers, holding her hand, and you can see the castle in the back with a rainbow. Ooh, a Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Look how cool. They're mining their jewels. We have Cinderella's cottage in the back. Cinderella, oh my gosh, Snow White. Snow White in the back. Look at them. We have the small Aristocats piece. We have a Safari, Mickey and Minnie with their Safari Jeep. And we have Goofy, Donald Duck and Pluto. We also have Peter Pan. Ooh, so we have Peter Pan, we have Wendy and her brother, Captain Hook with TikTok. I love it. Wherever Captain Hook is, TikTok has to be right behind him. And we have the mermaids right at the rocks. Oh, this is cool. But look at this other one, guys. Hold on. This one. They are flying. Flying over London. And we have TikTok in the clouds. We have Captain Hook in the clouds. The ship. This is so cool. Christopher Robin and Winnie the Pooh in hand with all the other characters. And then we have another Winnie the Pooh one. And this one, Winnie the Pooh, is kind of flying because the balloon is just kind of lifting him up. Christopher Robin trying to bring him down. This is so cute. And here we have Rapunzel and Eugene from Tangled in the famous lantern scene. I love it. <laughs> The gold on these lanterns really just glows. And then here we have another Rapunzel and Eugene swinging in her hair with her mother on the tower. This one is beautiful. Here they have the small $59 canvas of the 50th anniversary painting. And like I told you, only the original art pieces which are framed have the glitter. This one does not have the glitter, but it's still stunning. Here is the framed Mickey and Minnie in a grease painting and it comes with this golden frame. Oh, and this size, it's a thousand dollars this 50th anniversary one is even bigger and this one is three thousand nine hundred and twenty dollars this one is 53 out of 150. here we have mickey and fantasia oh, i hadn't seen this one look at all the uh, broomsticks these are the smaller ones, so it's $59. So the framed painting, it says with the one where Mickey and Minnie is looking at Steamboat Willie, it's called 90 Years of Mickey. And this Christmas piece is called Mickey's Victorian Christmas. 
and it is 20 out of 195 and this framed one is a thousand dollars for a thousand dollars they have the beauty and the beast framed look at you can see the castle oh here in this one because the smaller ones that i showed you you could not see gaston with the mirror on his horse oh you couldn't see this so these are really nice these framed ones they are a little more pricey but you can see a lot more detail because it's not cropped oh look at maurice her father with clogs worth up there oh look we have the enchantress with the rose wow this is really good and this one is a thousand dollars and it is 64 this one here out of 195 The new pieces to the collection are the Star Wars ones. Um, this one is a thousand dollars. It comes in this matte frame and it's called The Mandalorian A New Direction. They have these wrapped canvases for $89. It's like a small medium size. You can see it relative to my hand. Let me show you like a frontal perspective. All right, so this is the size, so you get an idea. We also have Marvel canvas wraps for $89. baby yoda here for 89 dollars canvas wrap i think this would be my favorite star wars one it's epic So this is what they mean by original sketches. He's sketching Mickey, um, the artist, in the back of a canvas wrap, which is really cool because they are purchasing this small canvas wrap. And the artist who's sketching right now is Dirk Wonderlick, and he's also signing. In the back, they have the Certificate of Authenticity and this is where the artist will sketch an original sketch and they will also sign the front. Um, but this is only during the month of July, which uh, Thomas Kincaid is having this event here at the Art of Disney. Now he's doing a much larger sketch on a much larger painting. And it's the 50th Cinderella Castle. this art of disney thomas kincaid studios day with me if you like this video give it a big thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this go ahead and click subscribe i do disney merch videos a lot of disney merch updates and if you have any questions or comments leave them down below and tell me what was your favorite painting and i cannot wait to see you guys again very soon bye